Hey guys, this is Liam here, and today I have for you another Minecraft tutorial. Today we are going to be exploring the world of leashes. Um, recently, uh, Wreckabilly put up a video about how to leash mobs to a pole. And um, I thought, well that's nice, but I've seen that people using MCEdit can leash mobs uh, not only to poles, but uh, to um, like each other. So I thought, well, let me look into this. So I was looking up stuff on the internet, and I found a Reddit post thing that was asking if it was possible, and somebody said how to do it. So I thought I'd put up a video, because there are no actual videos up, and nobody wants to go searching around trying to find it. So I, and, you know, looking at reading things and stuff. So I decided I'd put up a video, and so here it is. Now, um, what you want to do is you want to summon your first mob. Now, this is the mob. Is this mob? It can be anything you want. I took put pig. Well, it can't be anything. It can't be a minecart rideable. It can't be a wolf. I'm sure there are some other ones, but I haven't looked into it. Probably no falling sand or anything like that. And then what you have to do, if you're going to do any arguments for the thing, this you'll put these along with that. Um, so like if you had like right, I mean, you know, if, if you had like being saddled or riding something, you you know, you just put this along with that. So you put UUID least colon 2L, and it is p imperative that you have the L here. And then comma UUID most colon 3L. Again, need the L, and make sure everything is capitalized like this. And have your curly brackets closed. And then, and then what you want to do is you have your second mob. Now this one has to be spawn summoned first, or else it won't work. And then you have this one. So I chose a villager. Well, the person actually had the villager. Um, and then I had at least the pig. So uh, where I found this, they had a villager. So summon villager. Uh, they put it two up. You could have one where, wherever you want. Um, then UUID least colon 2L comma UUID most. The same, sorry, the same as the other one, basically. And then leash is colon 1. And leash is to the UUID least 2L and the same as this one over here. But I'm not sure about this one. The this one like I tried it without it and so I think it must be there. I don't know why, but maybe they're supposed to have like UUID least and most. I I don't know. But that's basically how you do it. Uh let me, let me show you. Now there are some glitches with this. When you first summon them, um uh, they are indeed leashed but you cannot see it and uh... it's really kind of glitchy and then if you like log out and log back in it may or may not show up and then if you like if you get it to show up then if you log out and log back in it may not show up but as you'll notice this pig is going to walk away and it pulled the villager with it see so it's pulling the villager with it uh... wherever it goes because it seems that the villagers can't pull other animals but other mobs can pull villagers it's really kind of weird but um... let me leave the game and hope it works this time let me wait for a few seconds because that seems to work and you still can't see it let's try this one more time please work if it doesn't work then oh wait yeah you can see it there you go Oh. Oh my gosh, whoa, leg. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, I don't know where that leg's coming from. Um, You can kind of see it in there. Uh, you can't really see it at this angle. See, there you go. There's the leash. So that's it, everybody. Um, I think I'm going to have to stop here because it's getting really laggy all of a sudden. I don't know why. Uh, so that's it. Thank you for watching. Be sure to bludgeon that like button. And uh, if you enjoy this, please um, check out my channel for more of my cool stuff. Thank you.